What's up everyone? Today we're testing your ninja skills because we are making Chinese spicy and sour shredded potatoes. Forget everything you knew about potatoes, this recipe is taking them to a whole other level. Of course I'll be sharing some of my favorite hacks with you. One of them is on how to slice your potatoes really nice and thin and the other one is on how to prepare this dish without even using your stove. So let's get into it. My name is Andong and this is the Chinese shredded potato recipe, also known as tu dou si. Just real quick before we get started, make sure you subscribe to my channel. I'm sharing my favorite Chinese recipes and my goal is always to simplify and cheat as much as I can while staying true to the spirit of the dish. Okay, now let's get back to those potatoes. So for this dish, large, long and even potatoes work the best. But the number one most important thing to getting this dish right is to slice your potatoes really, 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 really thin. And there are tools for that. For example, you could use a julienne slicer which works pretty well. Maybe you even have a mandolin slicer at home. That's even better. But if you know me, I really don't like recipes that rely on specialized equipment. That's why we're gonna be training our ninja skills and slicing our potatoes with a good old knife. And that can get pretty tricky, but I got your back. So after washing your potatoes, and I actually like to leave the skin on, cut off a little slice from one of its sides. This will help you stabilize your potato. And if you're experienced with a knife, you could just slice it thinly now. But you know what? We can do even better. Take a fork and stick it into your potato like this. Apply a little pressure with your supporting hand and carefully slice until you can feel that you're getting close to the fork. Now stack your slices and stick a toothpick in the back to hold them together. And now slice again. And there you go, super thin potato shreds. And you know what? That was the hard part. The rest of the recipe will just be a breeze. So now we have to cook the potatoes. And if you've done a good job slicing them really thinly, here's another hack for you. Place them in a bowl and pour boiling water over them. Cover and let them sit for about 10 minutes while you prepare the other ingredients. This method makes sure that your potatoes are just barely cooked, which gives them this amazing crunchy texture. Now grab a green pepper. Try to go for the thin-skinned pale green variety. Cut off both ends and spread out the middle part like this, skin side down, and now slice. Add it into the hot water bowl along with the potatoes. Next, slice some dried chilies, just use your scissors. Add some salt, sugar, and MSG. MSG! <sighs> yes, return of the MSG. Guys, we've already talked about this. If you're not okay with it, just leave it out. <sighs> Probably gotta have a conversation about this. Now mince a clove of garlic and our aromatics are all ready. Drain your potatoes and peppers and place them in a bowl. Add your garlic and your aromatics. Now go in with a bit of soy sauce, white rice vinegar and sesame oil. And as always finish off with some smoking hot oil and enjoy the sizzle. Give everything a good final mix and boom! Now go call your ninja friends and enjoy the incredible crunch and spicy tanginess of Chinese shredded potatoes. If you have any recipe requests, let me know in the comments below. And of course, don't forget to head over to my channel. I have a whole bunch of other cool things there. Check them out and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.